hey guys welcome back to my channel um i know this is a horrible angle but i am getting ready right now it is sunday what date is it i don't know what day it is but i guess it's like the 20th maybe yeah yeah i think it's the 20th um i'm getting ready uh, i haven't done my hair yet right now i'm working on my makeup uh, we are going to Waco today. I think we're going to Waco. I'm not sure, but I think Waco. Um, Ulises' birthday is actually in a few days, so three days to be exact. And I am actually taking him on like a little shopping spree for his birthday. That's going to be his gift for me this year. I'm going to actually let him pick his gifts. Um, he doesn't want to do that. He actually doesn't want anything. But I told him I want to buy him something. So we're going to go to some of his favorite stores. And I'm going to bring you guys along. Um, look at this little big old makeup sponge I want. I think it's a body sponge, but I've been using it for my face and I love it. Anyway, uh, let me finish getting ready and then I'll be back. Alright you guys, so I am completely ready. Um, I don't know if I talked about it on my last video, but I am going blonde again. Um, I guess for summer? I don't know. I was just ready for a change. Um, I was going to do just like a simple makeup look, and I ended up <laughs> with red lipstick. And I'm like, girl. I do this all the time though. So yeah. But I think my makeup looks pretty good. I'm looking this way because I, that's where I can see myself. Um... But I'm ready to go. So I'm picking out my jewelry. Um, I have these little pearl studs from Kate Spade that I love. I actually got them at the mall at the Kate Spade store and they had a little discount around Christmas time. So I love those. Um, my nails are super cute. I got them done on Friday. As you can see, I love little pearls. These are all little pearls on here. They're so cute. Here's what I'm wearing. It's just this little crop and these pants. They flare a little at the bottom. I don't know if you can see, but they do. And I always carry this bag with me, but the one I actually take down is my little Steve Madden crossbody. Yeah. Here we are ready to go. I think we're taking my speedy. So you guys, tell me why they could only take cash. And I never have cash. Um, I was gonna pay with a card. And then I just happened to mention like, oh, can you take a check? And thank God I had my checkbook in the car because I was able to pay with the check. I've never paid with the check in a store. So that was something new, but thank God for old timey checks. And so the reason that they couldn't take um, the card was because all of their car readers were down, which is weird for cabiners because I feel like they'd have like a backup system, but I guess not. Um, but yeah, I almost didn't bring my purse today, but I always bring my big purse with me and I just take down the small one and 
that ended up working out we're not from Waco so I don't even know where the closest ATM is and we were gonna have to go all the way over there get cash come back and it was just a whole mess so thank God and thanks to me that I had my checkbook um now we're going to go eat we're going over there World Market um, creo que tienen muchas cosas. Si quieres hablar de vamos. Okay, we're gonna go eat and then I will be back. Okay, so we're at Cabela's. We're looking at fishing rods. These little babies are expensive. <laughs> There's all different kinds. I don't really know. Really? Why? But it's not necessitas. No, it's not good. Porque puedes llevar como uno normal también palmar, right? Sí. No más que sea resistente. We're looking at these. Um, I, don't, I think he's gonna choose one of these. So he made up his mind and he chose that one. It's really big. Um, but he's super excited. Is that. ¿Qué pescado vas a sacar con esa? So catfish. So he's taking it apart to put it in the car. Um, it's so big. So we are finally back home. Um, we had a really good day. Um, Ulises ended up getting two pairs of jeans, two uh, caps, and he got his super nice high quality fishing pole. Um, he has a few fishing poles, but I wanted him to get like a really good one because, and I, and I know it's something that he would never buy for himself. So that's why I pushed him to get that because I know he wants it really bad, but it's one of those things where you feel like it's too much to spend on yourself. So that's why I convinced him to get his fishing pole because I know it's something he's wanted for a while. Um, he has quite a bit of them, but this specific one is super sturdy. It's very long and it's uh, basically so he can get bigger fish. Um, we ended up going to the store called World Market. I had never been there, but one of my coworkers told me that I should go there. Her name is Darlene because she said they have a lot of really neat stuff. So we ended up going and I got, they have like a big mix of stuff. Um, I got this shea butter uh, lotion um, in scent coconut. It's a glass bottle, which I thought was pretty neat. And now that we're home, I can actually open it up. And I love body butters, so when I saw this said body butter, I was like, sold. Oh yeah, this is thick. I love thick body butters. Um, oh, it smells good. So I got that. I also got a well, lotion all over my hand. Um, peach uh, apricot fruit spread. So it's basically like a jelly or jam, whatever this is. Um, we always have this because Ulises uh, has toast every morning for breakfast with his coffee. So we were out of Nutella, which is what I bought last time we went grocery shopping. So I got that. And then I got a little um, knife. So these come, you usually have seen them with the charcuterie boards. It was only 99 cents. I got it because for my butter, I always keep a butter dish Look, here on the table. I always keep my butter on the table to put on stuff and we always have to get like a 
a butter knife or something from the drawer, but now I'm gonna leave this one here so we can just use that and it fits perfectly in the little dish. And then I also got a bottle of wine. It's like imported from France. I have that in the fridge, but anyway, that is all. We had a great day. I wanted to spoil Ulises for his birthday because he's such a good husband. He treats me so good. He puts up with me. I feel like I'm a pretty good wife, but I'm pretty emotional and I am very spontaneous. I always have him doing stuff up, up and down and he's always so supportive in everything I do. So I wanted to treat him really good um, for his birthday, which is on Wednesday. It's on a weekday, so that's why I wanted to do this on the weekend. He ended up having to work yesterday, which he usually doesn't have to work Saturdays, but it just so happened that this Saturday he did. I took him to a very nice lunch. We went to Longhorn. Is it Longhorn? Something steakhouse, and he had a big old steak that I showed on here. We didn't really do anything for me. We just went to the World Market store because that's where I wanted to go and it was right next to um, where Cabela's and Cavender's was. So yeah, Ulises is ama an amazing husband. I am super, super lucky to have him um, because he is so respectful. He <laughs> is so patient with me and I feel like we balance each other out pretty well. He takes care of me whenever I feel bad. He is always attending me and making sure I'm okay and constantly uh, checking up on me and bringing me medicine and cooking for me and cleaning. He does it all um, whenever I don't feel good or even like when I'm tired, he helps me out in the house. Why is my light playing me? Um, so yeah, he's a wonderful husband and that's how I wanted to treat him um, on his birthday, even though it's in a few days. But anyway, happy birthday to Ulises. That is all for this video. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you guys again next time.